In this video, we're diving into a collection of 12 thrilling new mods that will enhance your experience in ways you never thought possible. From immersive gameplay tweaks to jaw-dropping visual upgrades, we've got it all covered. So grab your sword, don your armor, and let's embark on this epic journey together. First up, we have No Furniture Camera. This mod removes the furniture camera, allowing you to use the regular third-person camera instead. This provides a smoother and more enjoyable experience, especially when using climbing mods like Animated Traversal. Additionally, when used in conjunction with true directional movement, you can freely manipulate the camera even during furniture animations, preventing sudden changes in camera angle. Next, we have Sposs's New Flame Atronach. This mod gives a feminine touch to the appearance of the Flame Atronach. The facial features become more distinct, and the chest and hips stand out more. The hair resembles flames, and the carapace-like armor protects the exterior of the Flame Atronach. If you're a fan of Pezboss series creature replacers, you should definitely give this one a try. Next up, let me introduce the mod, FYX Nordic Doors and Traps Collisions. This mod adjusts the collisions of Nordic doors and traps, allowing players to shoot down enemies with bows or magic through the bars of the door, enhancing immersion. Now you can quickly escape through the door and attack enemies beyond with ranged weapons or spells. In this time, introducing an amazing mod that addresses the animation bugs that have been bothering you. It's called Skyrim Weapon Switch Animation Fix. This mod specifically targets the animation glitches that occur when changing or equipping weapons while moving. It corrects these bugs using vanilla animations, ensuring that the proper animations are displayed when drawing or sheathing weapons, even during movement. Many players may have experienced frustration due to this bug. Now, you can use this mod to resolve the issue. Next up, introducing the mod, Tell Mithrin Overhaul, High Poly and Improved Meshes. This mod enhances the Telvani mushroom houses, making them more beautiful and detailed. It adds new 3D ropes and intricately ties them to the wooden pillars. The entrance door frames are adjusted more appropriately, and the metal ring meshes are refined for a more natural look. Overall, it upgrades the meshes of Telmithrin. Give this mod a try to experience the improved meshes of Telmithrin. Next up is Malignus Animations, Female Idle Walk, Run, and Sprint. These animations provide a more natural and graceful touch to the idle, walking, running, and sprinting animations of female characters. They are compatible with true directional movement, support target lock, and do not require any additional animation framework, although the player-exclusive version requires OAR. The animations are gender-specific, applying only to female characters. Give them a try if you like the movement animations in the video. In this time, let me introduce the mod Dynamic Block Hit. We've mentioned this mod before. Dynamic Block Hit adds animations that are compatible with Maxu Block Overhaul. It triggers different block hit animations when blocking regular and power attacks. Additionally, it provides random block hit animations for each weapon group, along with extra special block hit animations. Now, this mod has been uploaded to Nexus, so you can download it through Nexus. Next, I'd like to share an update about Better Third Person Selection 0.5.9. Dated September 9th, the 0.5.9 update for Better Third Person Selection addresses a CTD related to scale form logger allocation and fixes some filter-related issues in specific situations. Especially since the CTD issue has been resolved, I wanted to inform you about this update. If you're interested, feel free to update the mod. Next up is Spaghetti's Faction Hall's High Hrothgar. 
Spaghetti's Faction Hall's High Hrothgar adds suitable decorations to High Hrothgar without causing excessive changes that could lead to FPS drops or compatibility issues. Instead, it adds noticeable details to key areas of High Hrothgar for a fresh feel. This mod adds new records without modifying vanilla ones, ensuring good compatibility. If you wish to use it alongside other mods, feel free to request a patch from me. This mod is flagged as an ESL file, so it won't take up space in your load order. If you like this mod, feel free to use it without hesitation. Next, we have Diverse Bird's Nests, Base Object Swapper. Diverse Bird's Nests, Base Object Swapper, uses a tool called Base Object Swapper to change bird nests into 18 different shapes. For example, you might come across nests with cracked eggs, hatched eggs, more or fewer eggs, nests of varying sizes, or nests with feathers and other intriguing items. Since the nests change when cells load, you'll encounter a variety of nests as you travel through Skyrim. This mod is based on the assets of a mod called Conj's Nests and Eggs, so be sure to install that mod first and then overlay this mod's meshes on top of it. Next up is the Animated Traversal, Stamina Cost Add-on. The EVG Animated Traversal, Stamina Cost Add-on, adds a stamina cost to using these animations. This introduces a cost to using the animations, meaning that if you use them multiple times before combat, you may find yourself at a disadvantage due to decreased stamina. This mod sets the stamina cost between 10 and 20, depending on the difficulty of the animation. For example, climbing walls or jumping down consumes 20 stamina, while passing through consumes 10 stamina. This mod operates by modifying the spells of the Evgat mod, so an update to the Evgat mod may be required. Finally, the outfit I'd like to introduce is the Elegant Posture 3BA, created by Lilyrim. This outstanding outfit mod adds elegant dresses in four different colors. The physics effects of the straps around the neck and the long flowing skirt are remarkable, and the semi-transparent sleeves and skirt evoke images of noble women. It supports accessories, earrings, and a dedicated wig, while the ornamental belt at the waist further elevates the quality of this dress. Currently, this outfit is available for free through Patreon, giving you the freedom to use it or support the creator. We hope this outfit captures your heart. And there you have it, folks. 12 incredible mods that are bound to elevate your Skyrim adventure to a whole new level. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more exciting content. Leave your thoughts in the comments below and share your favorite mods with the community. Until next time, may your travels be safe and your battles be victorious. See you in Tamriel.